Right now, food truck owners are pushing for change in Virginia Beach. They say the city's laws are outdated and it's costing everyone money. Those truck owners are rallying during city council's retreat. 13 News Now reporter Aaron e. LeBeau is live at New Realm Brewery. And what kind of change do they want? Yeah, David, I'm actually right in front of Sofrito, which is one of the food trucks that was parked outside yesterday of Virginia Beach City Council's retreat location. Now, the owners tell me that it was their way of being present right before council members went in to discuss city business, and they say they hope to be a part of that discussion as they are pushing for new food truck laws. Food truck owners like MJ Medler are pushing city leaders to vote for an ordinance that would allow food trucks to set up shop in the city. Well, currently, the trucks are not allowed to serve on private or public property unless there's a permitted event. Monday, supporters rallied outside the city's annual retreat, hoping to get council's attention to change that. If we have an actual ordinance in place that can be enforced um, and that everyone can abide by, then we can actually make the industry um, a safer. The ordinance would include some places that food trucks would not be allowed, like Atlantic and Pacific Avenues at the oceanfront, but give operators some options like setting up on public side streets and in business parks. I think that it's a, it's a represents a bigger picture of what the city needs to be focusing on, which is our small businesses. And also speaking of the, those businesses, next week city council members are actually expected to vote on this ordinance and these business owners say they plan on being there. Reporting live in Virginia Beach, I'm Erin e. LeBeau, 13 News Now.